All right, this is our fifth case of Leaf 2020 Greatest Hits. These are our teams. If they're in a professional uniform, it's a no-brainer. It goes to that professional team. You'll see that the baseball spots have the uh, non-Big Four sports comboed up with them in case we hit one of those. Uh, if it's a Panini product in baseball with just a city, it goes to the pro team of that city. If the city has more than one pro team, we'll make sure it gets where it's supposed to go. If it's a uh, non-logoed card for any sport, like Team USA, college, anything like that, high school, um, and they're a current player, it'll go to the team they're on right now, with the exception of football, goes to the team they finished the season with. Because we don't start the new football teams until the new season officially started. Hockey, um, hockey, baseball, and basketball are now all pretty much in session or about to be in session. The hockey was paused. Um, multiplayer cards, you got to own 50% or more. That's two, or th two of a three-way, two of a four-way, three of a six-way, four of an eight-way. Otherwise, it goes to the randomizer. Uh, if it's a retired player with no logos in any sport, it goes to the team they played the most seasons with. If they played for two teams the same number of seasons, the tiebreakers total games played. If we get one of the special redemptions, like for a box of cards or something like that, something that we can't determine what team it's on, um, that'll be random to everybody in the break. Good luck. Books number one. This will probably be our last case of this. They bumped the price up again. I would have to go up into the 80s if I got another case of it. Because they bumped up the price again. I was so bummed because the price was holding and I was able to buy. I was able to buy some. Keep buying it, but tis what it is. Looks like the Orioles are going to be the first one on the board. This is a U.S. Baseball Collegiate National Team. Adley Rushman. Numbered 15 of 30. And I believe he was the first overall pick for the Orioles, if I'm not mistaken. Dr. Wilson. Mint 9, 2015 Panini Flawless, Kevin Durant, Russell Westbrook, Dual Diamond Memorabilia Emerald, 3 of 5. And that is for the Thunder, Thunder, Thundercats. Thunder, Thunder, Thundercats. G-Dub. And Rookie, Shackalicious. Authentic autograph from Beckett. It is on his 92-93 Stadium Club Rookie. I believe 92-93 is the draft card, right? Yep. 2000 draft pick. Shaquille O'Neal. For the magic. Damn Dean. Last spot mojo. Box number two. For the Tampa Bay Lightning, Steven Stampkos, Young Guns, 9-5 from 0809 Upper Deck, Tampa Bay. Who had the old Lightning? A G-Dub? Old guy. 72 tops, Roger Dodger. 
Roger Stallback for the Cowboys, SGC 5 5. Roger Dodger for the Cowboys, baby. Dr. Wilson. And at 89, Upper Deck, Ken Griffey Jr., PSA 9. For the Seattle Mariners. Billy P. Billy P. Last box. Don't give up without a fight. Got one box left. Eighty one flair. Harold Baines, a gem mint ten for the White Sox. The White Sox are Lake Sports. Got a mint nine. Barry Sanders rookie for the Lions. Lions are Dr. Wilson. And the last hit of the break. Prism Trey Young for the Atlanta Hawks. PSA 9. Trey Money for the Hawks. Anthony C. Wasn't as good as the last case, but it was okay. It was solid. Harold Baines. All right. I'm going to look it up. Lake's giving me crap again. I don't know anything about this card. Flair 81 Flair. There you go, Lake. I know you're just going to sell it anyhow. PSA 10, Harold Baines, Fleer, Rookie 81, $132. One sold for a hundred dollars, so you're right in there. You're right in there. Uh, the t there's I don't know. Well, you sell yours for forty then. Sell yours for forty. Anybody want to buy Lakes for forty? Anybody want to buy Lake Sports? Uh, Lakes wants to sell his for 40 because she thinks that's all it's worth. <laughs> Maybe if you would get his.